Last Thursday, parents across the country began receiving payments from the IRS in an effort to offset some of the costs COVID-19 brought to those with children. 3 News Network reporter Jessica Edson spoke with tax experts and those in the child care field about the new advanced child care tax credit. Over the past 18 months, the cost of getting your child diapers, keeping them fed, and bringing them to daycare has been on the rise. With some parents still working to get ahead after COVID or facing new expenses as they head back to work, the advanced child tax credit will be a help for some families. For a lot of those parents who you know either don't have a job or are struggling financially to make child care needs met, this is a huge increase for them. Some parents may even be able to offer their kids things that go beyond the basics with the automatic extra $200 to $50 to $300 per month. And just having some extra money right now for people is going to give them that extra window to maybe be able to try something beyond just child care to be able to get their kids involved in community activities. But for other families, opting out of the tax credit may be better. It's important for families to remember that the extra money is an advance on the yearly tax return they'll get next spring. I do think that people are not going to realize that and that they think that this is um, money coming from the government as a stimulus fund uh, type of payment and not realizing that this is, you know, really, truly part of their uh, existing you know, part of part of their existing tax return. Tax experts add that for those who share custody, the advance payments may have one parent actually owing money come tax time. If you claim the child on your 2020 tax return, but for instance, you don't get to claim them, the other parent does in 2021, um, you're going to receive that advance, but it's going to get reconciled. The best course of action, talk to a tax expert about your financial situation. Just like anything, certainty cures a lot of things. So whether it's good or bad, uh, at least you know, and you're not surprised at the end of the day. Reporting in Omaha, Jessica Edson, 3 News Now.